Hello, dear students. Here is Shob Ab with a new lesson in Welcome Unit, Lesson Eight. And today I talk about cardinal and ordinal numbers. Cardinal a cardinal number is a number that shows how many of something there are. It's talk it it talks about an amount of something, and it's it's about the uh, quantity such as 1 2 3 4 5 extra at the end an ordinal number is a number that tells the position of something in a list such as first second third fourth fifth extra a cardinal number can be any number like 0, 59, 19, 25, 7, 11, 103, 70. Or you can you can you can say any number, for example, 225, 900, 1, or any number. So they are cardinal numbers. They are simple simple and easy to know about them at, th at the first we have to make a distinguish between teen and ty because maybe sometimes you are just confusing about them teen are used for the uh, smaller numbers but ty used for the bigger numbers in amount for example, 13, 13, and also we have 30. So this is 13, 13. It's not very big, it's not very much, but 30 is bigger. So 13, when we talk about the 10th, the 10th are these numbers. 13, and for 13 we have 30 so the when when you see teen so they are the lower uh, numbers and they are the smaller numbers for example we have 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 they take teen at the end of the word also we have also we have ty for example 30 40 50 60 70 80 90 so they are bigger numbers you have to know to you have to know about this number and you have to make a distinguish between teen and ty t we have some examples Aaron is 14 years old and his father is 40. So maybe you are just confused which one is teen, which one is T and the number 14 uh, is it is it the real for it's the real 14 or the 40 maybe you are just confused. So when you see teen teen it means 14. And his father is 40 40 40 is the bigger number we have another example i have 19 pencils but my friend has 90 pencil pencils so i have 19 pencils they are not very much but my friend has 90 pencils my friend has 90 pencils so it's very much ordinal numbers so at first you have to know that uh, how to change an a cardinal number to an ordinal number one this is the uh, number form and this is as a written so you have to know when you want to change it into the ordinal number it's gonna be first 
and this is how you can write first you take these two last letters and you put at the top of the number one st always only use only use with number one only number two and you see and when we want to change two to an ordinal number it's it's gonna be second second and also you can take these two last letters and put at the top of the number two and nd is only used with number two it's gonna be second number three third number four fourth number five fifth number six sixth number seven seventh number eight eighth nine ninth ten tenth eleven eleventh twelve twelfth extra we have an example or oh, you have some examples mina has three children mina has three children so three is a cardinal number the first the first child is 10 years old so we just use the an ordinal number the first child is 10 years old because we are talking about the position in something so we have to use an ordinal number the second child is seven years old we don't say the two child is seven years old we have to say that the second child is seven years old the third child is four years old using ordinal numbers to tell the date there is a common way to tell the date by using ordinal numbers in general for example we have this date how we can how we can write how we can read and how we can tell in a correct way we have to say today is july 24th 2017 instead of say 24 we say 24th on and in prepositions in is a preposition that uses with the months seasons parts of the day years century extra also you have so many things also we can use in with them we have on on is a preposition that uses with days birthday for example you say july 7th it also uses with a weekday and extra examples flowers are blooming in the spring because we have season we used in flowers are blooming in the spring i will visit my friend on sunday morning because we are we are talking about a moment in a day a part of the day we have to use on I was born in 1991 because we used year so we have to put in between uh, before the year my birthday is on July 24th so because we talk about a day a day in a month when we when we specified this so we have to we have to put on have to use on in summary a cardinal number is a number that shows the quantity of something such as one two three one hundred two hundred eleven thirteen twenty it's not different any number an ordinal number is a number that tells the position of something such as first second third fourth and extra in and on are propositions that use in different situations
Thank you, dear students, for watching. Thank you. Bye-bye.